How's it going guys? It's Fury here. Welcome to another video and today something very very important has happened. So let's go ahead and get right into it. And if you uh, do enjoy this video in any capacity, make sure to subscribe to the channel. It would really help me out. We're almost at 300 subs. Thank you so much. And leave a like as well. Let's talk about what happened. Okay, guys. So welcome, welcome. Um, first things first, I'm sorry I haven't had an episode of Factions out in a bit. We've been doing a lot of work off of Factions. So uh, let's just get into what's happened. So the prob the thing is, Warriors is currently... The strongest faction on the server just based off of power. Here's the thing. There are three big factions right now. Cheese, which has so many members. That is insane. Eight members and is all from Monkey Barrel. If you don't know them, it's Nico, Mario, all these guys, Buddy, Vance, all of them. Warriors is still the strongest currently as far as power, but I'm pretty sure Aaron and the girls also have much better stuff than us. So let's just go ahead and start with a tour of our current temporary base as we go on. So first things first, we have a full-on tree farm, um, automated sugarcane farm, tomato, um, sorry, potatoes, not tomatoes, wheat farms, all of that. We have some storage, complete smeltery, level um, 27 enchants, I think? Um, a couple of other things here, um, but yeah. Just little bases here and there, and, um, and mines, stuff like that. Extra storage rooms, things like that. We have decent decent gear, decent gear. Um, but we have a lot of information as to what has happened. So currently, the world actually has a problem. And what I'm saying is there is a full-out war on the server right now. It's only been two weeks. I'm going to cut to when I'm out of here, and then you guys will... Uh, where we're going to talk about this. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. Okay guys, after literally several minutes of searching, we found a landmass and we're going to go ahead and get grinding here as I explain what has occurred. What I'm telling you guys has happened in the last day and a half and it has become a full out war on the server. Do understand that none of this is, is a lie. Everything I'm saying has happened. Nico and his friends, um, Buddy Hind, Vance, you know, Holy Synth, those guys, they hop on the server. They hop on factions and they're like, you know what? We're going to make our own faction. They make their own faction called Cheese because that's like Nico's whole thing. He's a monkey with, with, with cheese. So they make a faction and they go exploring. They go exploring and they um, go across the water. They're, they're swimming in the ocean, right? And all of a sudden they just happen upon um, a desert. So like, okay, cool. There could be a desert temple here. So they're exploring the desert and they find a massive, this is all in Nico's words, by the way, they find a massive, like 300, like a hundred block long, um, line of sugarcane across the water line. And they're like, wow, well, this is definitely man-made. So they go along it and eventually they actually find one of the girls overworld bases. Now, they were absolutely going to raid it, but because it was claimed, they could not get inside because while claiming does not let, um, while claiming still lets chests be opened, you cannot break blocks so, and the doors are not be able to be interacted with. Boring. So they of course decided the next thing to do was kill all the animals that was in the barnyard along with dogs and all this kind of stuff. They killed every single animal in the vicinity and then they ran. Run. They ran because Aaron had come online and seen them and started chasing them. Aaron and the others are absolutely furious at this affront. They declared war. Now, if you don't know, my faction Warriors is currently allied with the girls, meaning that I have to fight for them because this is an affront. But that is not where it ended. They hunted down Nico and Buddy and Vance and they started trying to kill them and they did several times but eventually they were able to escape their wrath. Now you think this would be the end but no, they were angry, the, the cheese faction, they got angry at the fact that all they had done in their eyes was kill some animals. They weren't they didn't weren't even able to loot any of the items that were there. So they did what was necessary and they went and searched for their base. After a few hours of searching, according to Nico, they eventually found one of the girls' main bases. They lured creepers inside and wound up absolutely decimating the entire thing. Now, I don't have any footage of this because I was at school at this time while this was happening, but it was apparently a bloodbath on with, with no bloodshed, technically. Now, 
the girls had a very specific thing that they were hiding, and it was a lot of their resources. It was locked inside of a massive obsidian box, and Nico DMs me and says, we don't know how to get in, and I said, well, I don't know either. I'm also fighting for Aaron, so I can't really help you. And he sends me back this DM. We're going to find a way. They knew inside this box that they were going to find immense wealth and resources to help them in the fight, so they worked for a couple of hours and actually found a way inside using a boat glitch, and they were able to take everything every single item inside. Unfortunately for them, oh, maybe fortunately for, for Aaron, I suppose, there was no netherite or diamonds inside of the chest, according to Nico. But there were large amounts of building materials, other resources, including iron and coal, things like that. And they got off with every single piece of it, multiples of large chests full just absolutely tons of items. They took everything and ran. When Aaron heard of this, Aaron was absolutely furious, of course. Could not believe that they had been able to exploit a glitch in the game to actually <laughs> wind up taking all of their stuff in the base, and that is how it stands now. If you look on F-List, every time you die, your faction loses power. Currently, Cheese has no land, negative 47 power, meaning they have died. Let me do the math here. Every time a person dies, they lose three power. They've died almost 16 total times across them, and we don't know how many times it was for each person, but we know that Aaron has absolutely, Aaron and um, Piney, who is um, CC in the Discord, has been absolutely able to decimate them with their superior armor and weapons, but Nico has told me personally that as soon as they get netherite armor, they know that they can beat the girls simply from numbers alone, because the cheese faction actually has like eight members, while the girls only currently have two. Then again, they do forget that I am allied with them, and if I am called into battle, Battle, I will have to come fight them myself currently I don't have the best armor but that is what I will be grinding towards in the next few days and Aaron and I have already talked about sharing wealth in order to get um, both of us stronger and bring both of our factions to glory to overcome this this war actually might become a massive deal unfortunately I won't be able to catch a lot of it on camera because I'm at school during the hours when everyone's playing in fact I had a 16 hour long school day today and I got home 10 minutes ago I don't know exactly where this is gonna go guys but I do know I'm gonna be asking people from all sides to record their side of what is happening send it to me and I will be trying to put this into to a video format that for you all to see what is unfolding. I don't know what to say at this point, guys. So thank you all so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. I'm going to be putting out more content going over what is happening in my side of how I am helping the girls hopefully win the war on the back end. So make sure to subscribe for more of this kind of content. Thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate all of you, and thank you for getting us nearly to 300 subscribers. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Give me some feedback as to what you want to see in the future in the comments below. So, uh, yeah, that's all from me, guys. For now, I'm going to be searching for more items and trying to get my faction more stacked along with Aaron. So thank you all for watching one last time. Make sure to join the Discord down in the description. We're almost to 100 members down there. If you join, you'll be pinged whenever I go live or upload a video to keep best up with my content as possible. So I will see you all in the next video. Like and sub. Okay, bye. The spiders are invisible! <laughs> oh, no! Oh, my God. What, 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 what? Like and sub.